Well, the probe into security protocol following a deadly incident at Government House last year is nearing completion. The Minister of National Security gave our Cleopatra Murphy an update on the status of that report and how it will lead to changes at government facilities nationwide. Here's that report. The four-man review committee charged with investigating the circumstances surrounding the shooting death of Petty Officer Philip Propal at Government House and determining if there were any security breaches has completed and printed its report. Minister of National Security, the Honorable Marvin Dames, says he expects a formal presentation within the next week or two from the committee chaired by former Commissioner of Police Reginald Ferguson and includes former Commodore of the Royal Bahamas Defense Force Roderick Bowe, former Superintendent of Police Douglas Hanna, and former police officer and attorney Paul Jones. Dame says the report will also take a look at security at government buildings moving forward. We hope to um, introduce that, that soon. Um, a lot of it has, uh, some of it has financial implication. And right now we have to uh, put uh, things into priority. Uh, but uh, we promise that we would have uh, put together a policy on the protection of government building. As a matter of fact, I had a meeting on that just yesterday. Per Paul, a 30-year veteran of the Royal Bahamas Defense Force, was on duty in the guardhouse at Government House on April 28, 2019, when he was fatally shot. 34-year-old Defense Force Marine Javon Seymour was charged with Per Paul's murder and the attempted murder of two others, while the incident raised concern over security at Government House that is the official residence of the Governor General. In response to the incident, Dame says there is a policy that he presented to Cabinet late last year, and when government is ready, it will implement what it can without digging into the public purse. But he says it is crucial to change the way government buildings are protected. For example, in the United States, any of the federal buildings, and that's always an example I use. Uh, you can't just walk in. Uh, we, we have moved into our new headquarters, and I don't know if you had an opportunity uh, to visit. Uh, but uh, we had some of your colleagues visited, and they were told at the reception area that they could not bring their phones up. we got to get serious about the way we do things. Uh, we have to get professional, but we must put structures in place, and that's what we like to do. We like to research, look at the best way forward, then implement, put the policies together. Dame says now that there is a foundation, there will be a noticeable change. Certainly if you come to the Ministry of National Security, and we're doing the same for the Prime Minister's office, the office of the Prime Minister, and the, the objective is, is to go throughout every government, government ministry, every important building throughout this country. Cleopatra Murphy, Satanas Network News.